In solid tumors, especially, we know that it's not enough, all what we are doing right now, but um, CRISPR now, I think they offer the unique opportunity to um, have the possibility to destroy whatever you know that is uh, counteracting the action of your T cells. For example, you have the possibility to perform a disruption of those genes, of those molecules, and so enhancing the efficacy of the T cells. Um, however, I have to say that um, there are also some other some other new tools that we can now focus on, like I already mentioned the base editing that will enable the uh, reduction of the off-target uh, problem and also of the safety concern because you don't have the translocation issues anymore that you might have with CRISPR technology. Because with CRISPR, you, must, you may also have, if you destroy multiple genes at once, the uh, translocation of the uh, double strand bricks that you have. So the portion of the broken DNA, they can uh, rearrange with each other. And so you might have translocation or with base editing, you may reduce this uh, problem because you will have a single mutation, a single base permutation. So in this way, you reduce, of course, this problem, but also uh, on the next step, we have also prime editing. That is a search and replace genome editing tool that enables to directly write new genetic information exactly in the position of the genome where you want to introduce this information. And with this also, you don't have any problem with, the, you don't have any needs for double strand bricks or donor DNA templates. So in this way, you will also overcome those limitations. And uh, the other thing that I think is a next step level is the epigenome editing. Because also in this way, while with CRISPR, you are destroying uh, genes into the genome, with the Epigenome editing, you can activate repressed endogenous gene expression so you can control the gene regulation. So it is at the next level. But uh, you're right, on the solid tumors, we really need now to work much more and much harder in order to identify the proper <laughs> uh, setting to make the T cell products work better in this uh, immunosuppressive microenvironment.